This is Scales, the bane of all Skyrim Jarls. After a rampant streak of ding-dong ditching every single Jarl in Skyrim, Scales was placed under Imperial arrest, with an endorsement from the Stormcloaks for his execution. Scales eventually escaped captivity, but now he must go through three levels of challenges in which the victims of his ding-dong ditchery seek to end the Lizard's life of hard crime. Today we will try and help Scales pass these trials in an effort to answer the question, can you play Skyrim if a Jarl spawns every 10, 3, and 1 seconds? Now for level 1 the rules are simple, Scales has just escaped captivity and we need to complete the Bleak Falls Barrow dungeon. A hostile Jarl is going to be spawning on Scales location every 10 seconds, however these Jarls are assigned to their faction in the Skyrim Civil War so yes they will try and kill poor little Scales but they'll also try to kill each other. I've also set the player speed to 70% just to keep things a little bit more interesting on level 1 because after this it gets way harder. Get up, get, get, stop, you two? You're officially in timeout. Oh god, I'm I'm unbearably slow. This is just embarrassing. Come on, you're using a lot of dagger. I'm I don't have a dog in this fight. I'm just here for the entertainment. Layla is kick ass. She just punches. Whoa, 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 whoa! Lightning. That was not. Oh, that wasn't part of the deal. Oh, you found me. <laughs> Get... <laughs> High five, Yarl. Way to be a blocker. Way to be a blocker. Attaboy, Dengear. Okay, it looks like the townspeople are sick of the Jarl shit too. Sven's like, calm down, mother, I'll take care of it. This is amazing. Sven and Feindal are both on the same team. Wait, hold on, guys. You can't be leaving town to go fight the Jarls. I need to buy stuff from you. The only one to actually die is Sven. <laughs> oh, poor guy. Come on, that's my blacksmith. Jesus Christ, every single person that can help me is getting killed. Oh, Stump, Stump, no, we don't need you joining this fight, Stump. Damn it, Ulfric, back up. Somebody, somebody attack Ulfric, please. Oh my God, would you go get laid or something, lady? I get I chose the Argonian, but I wasn't expecting to be treated like this by all the Jarls. Attaboy Thongvar with the spinning attack, but blocked by Balgriff. Balgriff trying to break his defenses, can't do it. Thongvar pressing with the shield. Another couple hits on Balgriff. Balgriff with the block, he swings back right at his knees. And Brynna Merilis comes in cowardly to knock Balgriff down. He's only at half health, he's still fighting, holding out with just a sword, a being attacked from both sides. I can't do this anymore, I'm moving. How do MLG announcers do it? Ulfric returns. Ulfric smashes him against the wall. Ulfric is just an absolute madman. Ooh, it's Maven. Go. We gotta run from Maven. Is she following me down? Oh god, it's Ulfric. Jesus. That's I've had about enough out of your bullshit, Ulfric. Are they still fighting the spider out there? God, Ulfric. I see Ulfric's shouts are racially charged. Surprising nobody. And uh no, screw you, Ulfric. Suck it. Oh my god, they are all around me. Go. Go, 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 idiot dumbass. Hey, fight the skeleton. Okay, fight the naked skeleton. Don't worry about me. Oh, God, you guys are just driving me nuts. Hey, do you guys mind? Really, do you guys mind? I'm, I'm doing a... All right, single file line, everybody. It's a two-leveled cage match. You got the upstairs portion. You got the downstairs match. You got the fan favorite coming in in the middle to kick someone in the bottom of their jaw halfway through the fight. Oh, God, why me? <laughs> I'm just the announcer to this fight. You don't have to assault me, Ulfric. No. He killed me? I was having so much fun. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Jesus, I don't have any potions. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Get up. I'm not dying again. Don't hit me. Don't, please don't. I've lost track. There's got to be at least 10 Jarls in here fighting for power, though. Holy crap, there they go. Oh. Wait, Bogriff, no, get up. Hey, but hey, listen to me. No, you can't. We, we can't. Get the foot. I'm, I'm grieving over a friend. You've got like 25 people in here. You've got side fights over here. You've even got someone all the way running out. He's leaving. I'm going to be honest with you guys. Aside from a few highlights and moments, level one of this challenge was pretty lame. So I stopped the recording here and went to go rework some of the challenge with our friend DDM. And I asked him if we could change the respawn timer to three seconds instead of 10 and give every Jarl in the game the same unrelenting force shout that Ulfric was using. I figured this would spice it up a little bit. The goal of level two is to start right outside of Rift and enter the city, go through the city marketplace and assassinate Grella the Kind, the most awful woman in Skyrim at the Orphanage. I don't even have to convince the guard that I need to get in. Oh shit. Come on, scales. There we go. Oh no, it requires a key? I'm taking the horse. I'm taking the horse. <laughs> get who is that? I don't even know who these are. Oh shit. You guys could drag and shout me all you want. I'm getting to that back gate. 
God, I am. Oh, no, this is going to be brutal. I don't know if I can ever get out of this. I'm almost dead. Oh, my God, I did die. <laughs> yeah, come on, scales. Sprint, 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 sprint. What's the tax for? That's bullshit. Obviously, shakedown. Yes. <laughs> I can fly mid-conversation. Bullgriff, don't do it. Don't do it, Bullgriff. Oh, God, block for me. I shouldn't have watched, but I really wanted to. Oh, I can use I can use the stalls as cover. Jesus, it's mayhem. Go, <laughs> I'm with this guy. I'm with you, Snilf. Who's Snilf? Relax. Don't do anything rash now. Ah, shit, I said nothing rash. And apparently, why are the Riften guards pissed off at me? See, that's what you get. Oh, stay on the ledge. Hold on, Scales. No, God. Oh, that actually hurt. My chin went straight into the pole. Run, kids. Take cover behind Grelid. Wait, actually, why? Oh, no, why am I not trying to kill her? Level 2 was short and sweet, and while I was a bit disappointed in how short-lived it was, I wasn't prepared at all for this final challenge. Starting at the bottom of the path that goes from Iverstead all the way up to High Hrothgar, I need to follow the twisting path up the mountain while under siege from the army of angry Jarls. However, in level 2, where the Jarls were spawning every 3 seconds, here in level 3, the Jarls are going to be spawning once every second. They're still going to have their full shouting capabilities, and just because I wanted to go all out for this last one, we're giving the Jarls 300% movement speed. This is relatively easy. Okay, nope. <laughs> I spoke way too soon. I can breathe underwater. This is my strength. <laughs> oh shit, we're just going up the water now. This is going well. At least I'm in a safe area. <laughs> we're, like, we're like dead fish. Bye, e smear. Go, 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 go. Oh, we're making some progress. Okay, nice. We've got we've got a little break here. I don't have any sprint though, that's a big problem. No, wrong, wrong direction. Run, goat, goat, run, no, <laughs> no. I can do this, I know I can do this. What is the bear doing here? There's a bear on the bridge. Oh no, don't send me to the bear. No, <laughs> if they send me to the bear, I get killed. <laughs> He's still just hanging out. No, we're gonna take the river all the way down. Don't attack me. Eh, just back in. <laughs> at least I, at least I'm back where I belong. Oh my God! <laughs> they keep launching me out. You've done nothing but free me and make me strong. Never mind. I'm still alive. You haven't taken me out yet, bastards. Okay, okay, okay. I like this. I like where this is going. Come on, scales. Come on, scales. Oh God, they're laying it around me like bowling pins. Go. No, everyone, relax, please. We're right there. Okay, good. No, that, not me. See, I keep getting. Oh, <laughs> God. So the, the thing is, I have to stay out of the line of fire of Jarls and of civilians. Oh, my God. They just see ya. Oh, they keep they keep aiming up. You're an ass. That's just an asshole shout direction. Come on. <laughs> oh, my God. Come on. Am I alive? Did I make it through? I'm swimming. I'm finally going home. <laughs> Look at his little tail hanging out. Go, Scales. For fuck's sake, run. Get out of the way. Get up. What are, you, what are you doing in my way? You can do this. No! <laughs> As you can tell, Scales is having a bit of a rough time with this level. I never like to admit defeat, but after 20-something deaths without even making it past the first turn on the main path, we had to deploy a few lifelines in order to even the odds a bit. We gave Scales double health and a boost in stamina so we could run a bit longer and survive some falls. We also really sold our soul with this last buff. We increased Scales' speed by 200%, putting him at two-thirds the speed of the Jarls. After applying these buffs, our final run towards freedom begins. their railings do they not have a safety inspection team no scales no hold on grab a rock hang on for dear life no scales god stamina recharge is so slow oh that's a precarious little turn oh they're gonna hit the wolf go they're gonna target that wolf immediately and that's what hit me hang on scales bury your head in the snow Go ostrich style on him, or emu, or whatever the fuck it is. What's the bird that buries its head in the sand? Okay, we're on the move. Go, Scales. Making some progress. I, I have to hug the rocks. What What even hit me? Is it just windy? Am I, what, am I made of paper? Grab, grab something. Grab the snow. Have you ever seen Man vs. Wild? Do something. No way that killed me. Are you serious? You gotta be kidding me. That killed me? I've had harsher falls when sledding. I might be going so fast, I'm just falling over. It's the only explanation at this point. Eh, I'm, not, I'm not coming back from this one. See ya. I'm gonna get hit right up here. 
This is a tough one to dodge. It's such a long alleyway. There's a... Oh, what? How? Shout downwards. Please, shout downwards, but not at me. Thank you. This guy in Yes, he missed. Go, 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 go. Get up. Get the... Oh, my God, Scales. Get the fuck up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Grab something. Use your tail. You have a fifth appendage. No. Scales. Just a note I want to add to this part in post. This death was fucking bullshit. Scales. Scales. Get up. Oh, my God. I hate this. I fucking hate this so much. You got this. You got this. We're getting through this part. We're getting through this part. We've gotten through it twice before. We can do it again. Oh, my God. I love you, Ulfric. Go. Go, Scales. Run. Ah, uh, don't get hit. Don't get hit. Don't get hit. They're going to shout at the wolf. Get around the corner. Woo. Go. Go, 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 go. Come on, Scales. Come on. Do it for the freedom of all ding-dong ditchers. For the freedom of all people. Do it. For the one Argonian Jarl in Skyrim. We're about halfway there. This is the furthest we've been. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. We're right there. Scales, please. For the love of Christ, get up. Not that way. Wrong way. Please. Hey, 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 hey. Everyone, get around here because there's cover. Oh, my God. We had a seam. Go. Come on, Scales. You're on the 20-yard line. Just punch it into the end zone. Oh, my God. Could you imagine if I just got rocked in the back right there? Oh, <laughs> go. Scales, come on. Come on, baby. Don't fucking blow it now, Scales. Scales, you will earn your freedom. Go, 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 go. Yes, yes. 